so excited to get back and uh, we're all a family here, right? And it's just that we take care of one another and watch out for one another. We're swabbing all the employees that come into the lodge and making sure that it's a healthy and safe environment. Every mitigation measure that we've looked to do, we've analyzed it, enhanced it, and so at this point we really feel that the project is safer than it's ever been. I'm Edwin, your friendly bus driver. I feel safer here than I feel at home. Here we've got protocols, testing, and they want us safe and our wives want us safe. One of the biggest things is that they get to get out of their house and they get to come to work. And that's really good for your mental health. <laughs> and I see that enthusiasm um, with the people that are coming through, that they're glad to be working and, you know, fresh air and doing something productive. And those are big, big things for your mental health. As soon as you step right into the door, you know, seeing that signs, everything that's in place, like masks, and hand sanitizers, and, you know, that's just to protect the workers here, staff, everybody on site. I think the public can be very confident in the plan. We really want communities and everybody in the public to actually know what we're doing. We want to be sharing, we want to learn. There's people across this project that are working you know, literally day and night to make it as safe as possible. This is an incredibly organized system to keep people safe.